Hey guys, what's up? It's Queenie here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. It has been a while since I've sat down and just talked to you guys. I think the last video um, I did by myself, it was a voiceover, I think. And um, the last video I did in general was with a friend. So it's been a while. I've only posted four videos this year and we're about to hit April. So that's really, really bad. But I just needed to gather some things and just revamp my life and start fresh and I've been doing YouTube for so long and it's always been just a side okay no I won't say side it's always been a hobby it's something fun for me and um, um, I need to I started doing it at a time where I was kind of growing and transitioning into adulthood I guess and I feel like I've kind of lost who I am in this space so now that I'm a bit older I'm like okay I need to refine myself in this space and figure out why I'm doing this but that's not even for you guys to figure out you guys are just here for the content you're just here to watch and enjoy and that's what I'm here for so with that being said let's skip all that extra stuff all that what am I gonna do with my life <sighs> quarter life crisis nonsense because that's how I'm feeling but um yeah no we're good we're good i feel like it's been rough if i'm being honest but again that's not the topic of this video i'm just here to hang out with you guys and share some of my beauty um tips and tricks and uh, i look really tired today dang um i'm gonna show you guys a bit of my minimalistic makeup looks and i'm going to be trying merit beauty so the makeup came in this cute little bag look at this we do not waste over here they do not waste this is so cute i love that it didn't come in like um, like extra packaging like i can use this for the makeup and it came in one small box and that was it very very um just not wasteful the word for not wasteful um on my skin right now i don't have anything except for the laneige uh cream skin mist and this stuff will have you glowing it'll make you juicy have you glowing if you have dry skin or if you just need that extra like I look moisturized today this is so good I love it yeah let's get into this let's see I have a few things I have a complexion stick so like foundation I have a blush I have a um, mascara I have oh this is mascara what's this I have brow brow product and mascara I have um, highlighter balm um, we also have a blending brush, so I'm going to keep that out. And then a tinted lip oil, so that'll be last. But let's open up all of these. So this is the packaging. It's so cute and minimal. I love, I love. I have been living for like minimal makeup, and I know that's like what's pretty in right now anyways. I'm trying to keep up with the Gen Zs, you know, with the fluffy brows and the minimal face. I have never felt old in my life until now. It's actually crazy. I'm like, what's going on? I have to stay up to date with stuff. I can't just be me and be cool. <laughs> so funny. So um, yeah, my skin is pretty clear. I've been working months to clear this because I had a bit of a breakout from the summertime. And now it's pretty good. If you guys want to see a skincare routine, let me know. I'll definitely share that with you because I get hyperpigmentation very easily. So I have to make sure that I stay on top of my skin how are you guys doing i hope you guys are doing well in the midst of this ongoing pandemic i know depending on where you live it's better or worse in canada it seems like it's never going to end i feel like the people in the states are at least um at least experiencing things a bit better i don't know what's going on here i feel like we're a mess i feel like us and the uk are like on the same page like we just what's going on you know and people in like australia are living life <laughs> and um yeah it's unfortunate i guess what can you do okay so this is the complexion stick oh guys look at this beautiful this is so me look at that the gold and the brown okay let's see how it is oh yes oh, yes i tried to choose the color closest to my shade on the website and it's actually accurate oh my god yes it's so hard sometimes to find the right foundation online, but this is good. Let's use the brush that they provided. I don't know if it's for foundation. I feel like I would prefer a tighter brush. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Yeah. 
This is beautiful. This is so, 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 so beautiful. Okay, I love, I love, love, love. The fact that this is dark skin friendly makes me really happy. Like it doesn't look, um, it doesn't look ashy. It looks, oh, this is so perfect. Oh my gosh, do you guys see this? And if you didn't know, obviously probably not, I didn't mention, but it is available now at Sephora. And I feel like clearly the online um, models and how they show the makeup is very accurate because this is perfect. I wish I had a concealer to kind of brighten up my face, but it's okay. I just want to use what I have and see what kind of look I can make out of it. But this, this complexion stick, whoa, makeup wear. This is so nice. This looks amazing. I love minimal makeup. Okay, let's go for the brows. Let's go for the brows. I hope I chose the right color. I tried not to go too, too dark. I don't remember what kind of tool it is. Is it a brush? Is it, a, oh, okay. Yeah, it's a brush. The packaging is everything. Everything. Okay. Let's just brush out these brows and see how it goes. Okay, I guess I could have gone a bit darker, but it's okay. This brow always gives me problems. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, I could have gone darker. It's okay, because it keeps it very simple. And sometimes a lighter brow is nice, so whatever. Okay, so we have a nice set, brushed up, fluffy brow, I guess. Yeah, this one is ugh, annoying. Okay, so next, let's go in with the glow. Product. I'm not a huge highlight person, but let's see how this is. Oh, oh, this is nice. Oh my god. Wow, they really, really, really got this down. Okay, let me just put this on my nose. Just highlight a bit there. Just smooth this out. I don't want to pick up my yeah I'm not a huge highlight person so I think that looks okay um, let's try the blush okay so this is the packaging I love 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 this and I chose the color raspberry beret raspberry beret let's see oh. yes I like I like I'm just gonna pat it I'm just gonna rub it in with my fingers but I feel like it might be picking up the foundation a bit pat some on my nose okay so that's that I'm actually gonna use some of my own makeup just to touch up the parts that I feel like need to be touched up personally um, I think my under eyes could use some glow it's looking a little bit um, I don't know too shiny but I need to highlight under my eyes always like I just need to I wish I was able to I wish I would have got like a lighter complexion stick just to do that but I did not I'm just going to blend that out just to brighten it a little bit because that's what my face is missing it's looking a little <laughs> one tone which just doesn't look natural okay perfect i'm gonna add a bit more of this oh my god it broke oh my god are you serious oh my god okay guys <sighs> i am very disappointed very very disappointed because um i really like this and I had a lot of hope the brand is so great and I feel like now this is not good <sighs> things are expensive they cannot be breaking this is so bad I'm glad my dog didn't eat it Ugh. that sucks beautiful product but now that I see how much is in there and how it just broke I don't know 
the color is beautiful this is so sucks it sucks i was really hoping you know i could fully like it but damn so with the blush i'm actually gonna apply it with my regular blush brush just to give it some more like more of a chance i'm not a huge apply it with your fingers type of person anyway so let's just use the brush as i usually do okay so now i'm going to set under my eyes so i don't look so shiny under there because that is not where you want to be shining love i love the finish of this makeup it looks so simple but so refreshing i think i need more blush add a little bit of highlighter on my nose bridge just to brighten it up but yeah we're keeping it simple so now we have the mascara this is so beautiful the packaging is so on point guys um wow i love this long brush oh this is nice this is really really nice wow okay hmm. so mara beauty is all about minimal minimalistic makeup and that's why everything looks like this and feels like this it's like um kind of like this barely there makeup look and i love it yes i love that brands include dark skin in all their new trends and ideas now because it was hard i feel like before we only had a few options for what kind of makeup we wanted to do just because we weren't included very well in all the different makeup trends you know so right now minimal is in and we can also be a part of that they're able to make skin tints and just you know bb creams and all of that stuff that fit our skin i mean they were always able to make it they just chose not to but <laughs> i'm glad that i can easily shop in many different brands now and i love that if i want to do very light airy makeup i don't have to look ashy because that's what it was back in the day like you want to wear like bb creams oh you can look like a ghost <laughs> that's what it was like you literally would look great but this is good this is so good and now last but not least the lips we have the tinted lip oil in the color marrakesh i saw someone actually use this on my instagram i think it was um was it aisha so i don't know how to say so oh yes oh my god This is a tinted lip oil. Oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. I've been loving wearing my hair like kind of in a messy low ponytail with a bit of a bang out and some curls out and just seeing, just pinning and clipping whatever. So that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna tie it back and pin and clip things and see if it's cute. Okay, um, I think this is good enough. I feel like it is super minimal, super fresh. It's giving me very, when I do my hair like this and I have a makeup, I'm like, I feel very Bridgerton. Can they cast me please? Because I feel so just like classic, you know? I really love this. I hope you guys enjoyed this little trial. Um, I would definitely probably set under my eyes a bit more so it's less shiny. I hate seeing a reflection on these little lines here. Like it needs to look matte so I can look awake. But I like it. I feel like it's it's so fresh. It's very summer. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you guys enjoy, you know, sitting down with me. I hope you have a great week. We have a great day and, you know, I will see you guys in a couple days in another video because we have more coming. We already have more coming. I will see you guys soon. I will leave all the details to Merit Beauty down below so you guys can check it out check out their instagram their website you can shop there or you can get it at sephora so everything will be in the description if you are into minimal makeup like me i'm sure you will love it but i look i look i look good i look very um i look alive <laughs> i look fresh <laughs> you guys if you guys are into the whole minimal makeup look i'm sure you will love this but thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this quick little try out tutorial catch up hey i'm back this guy is gonna um if you guys enjoyed this little hey i'm back and um yeah thank you for clicking on this video i will see you all in the next one bye